happy 2019 as I suspect it's going to be a lot happier than the past two three thousand years that we've had under this uh, satanic dictatorship and apparently synchronicity 2019 2 plus 0 plus 1 plus 9 is 12 1 plus 2 equals 3 3 is for synchronicity expect right of time miracles all 2019 expect miracles in your business family and life path expect everything to come together and for everything to make sense soon and that's probably going to mean that everyone's going to realize that we have been run by satanists for thousands of years and the time to end it is now and of course the way they're, they're doing this, this is, this is the way I, I do things, this is how I work out and this is why the maximum number in quantum is 9 because when you add, if you look on your phone, what's the highest number? 9 and of course it starts with a 0, not with a 1 it's very important but a word to the 1% you control our world, you've poisoned the air we breathe, contaminated the water we drink and copyrighted the food we eat we fight in your wars, die for your cause, and sacrifice our freedoms to protect you. You've liquidated our savings, destroyed our middle class, and used our tax dollars to bail out your unending greed. We are slaves to your corporations, zombies to your airwaves, servants to your decadence. You've stolen our elections, assassinated our leaders, and abolished our basic rights as human beings. You owe our property, you own our property, shipped away our jobs and shredded our unions. You've profited off, off of disaster, destabilized our currencies and raised our cost of living. You've monopolized our freedom, stripped away our education and have almost extinguished our flame. We are hit, we are bleeding, but we ain't got time to bleed, we are being we will bring the giants to their knees and you will witness our revolution Jesse Ventura seven Canadian rules in life one make peace peace with your past so it won't screw up your pre the present what others think of you is none of your business time heals almost everything give it time don't compare your life to others and don't judge them you have no idea what their journey is all about stop thinking too much it's all right not to know the answers they will come to you when you least expect it no one is in charge of your happiness except you smile you don't own all the problems in the world in sweden a muslim migrant raped a 13 year old girl and got two months in prison also in Sweden, a woman faces two years in prison for an internet post offensive to Muslims. All governments are corrupt. And did you ever notice how, when you realise Oscar is a giant piece of weed? Uh, they call it weed, but it's the most precious plant that we've ever been given by the Creator. Universal credit surge in families begging for money online as benefit plunges households into destruction, destitution. Now, this of course is the government again. Uh, they're doing the job of trying to destroy the, the, the most desperate in our society, which of course you have to judge the society that allows that to happen, and it won't read very well for those that have allowed this to happen, and that's us because because we're all personally liable for what what is happening because we have allowed it time now to grow a pair of bollocks the size of basketballs and kick these corrupt bastards out once and for all if we allow this to go on it will eventually end in horror for us as well as everyone else we hand four million in aid to the USA how Britain doles out vast sums of taxpayers' cash to some of the richest countries in the world. A staggering total of 11 million of the, the British public's money went to rich nations. The countries include America, Japan, South Korea, Portugal and New Zealand, while we have homeless and starving in this country. Money comes from the Prosperity Fund, a Whitehall initiative set up in 2016. The money that we give away to other countries could end poverty in this country, could end homelessness in this country. 
but while we've got a satanic bunch of sick self-serving bastards in parliament it's going to continue and i think this will be their last year at least i'm visualizing that the return of louis the 16th emmanuel macron it's easy to imagine ridiculous young president emmanuel macron of france as his fellow free trading liberal king louis 16 macron's extraordinary pretensions to dignity of being a uh, and being a king far from elevating him have stripped stopped him uh, of the and his of all the bogus credibility that the corrupt servile and stupid mainstream media of Europe and the United States tried to give him. Yes, he's nothing more than a puppet for the Rothschilds at the end of the day. <clears throat> Retailers rejecting customers' cash as more banned paper money. Your cash is not wanted here. A growing number of retailers are, and restaurants throughout the US and UK are telling customers, but all the re are reasons being given by companies for the new cashless approach. Speed, efficiency, and the safety of store employees ve valid enough to require something as utterly and downright un-American as rejecting cash. Of course, this is a push for the cashless uh, society, which is will be total control of you. We must fight this tooth and nail. We must not allow it to happen. If we do, this, the consequences are immense. For 30 years, I've been obsessed by the, why children get leukemia. Now we have an answer. Well, let's read on and see if it's the correct answer. Newly knighted cancer scientist Mel Greaves explains why a cocktail of microbes could give protection against disease. Mel Greaves has a simple goal in life. He is trying to create a yogurt-like drink that would stop ch children from developing leukemia. Well, that's against the New World Order, that is. The idea might s seem eccentric. Cancers are not usually defeated but so simply. However, Professor Greaves is confident and give, given his experience in the field, his ideas are being taken seriously by other cancer researchers. And yet, the answer is in front of us. Don't eat shit food. Grow your own, eat vegetables and fruit, organic. That way, you won't get any diseases. Hmm. Theresa, <coughs> Theresa May reveals how her, her faith in God gives her confidence she's doing the right thing. What she's not telling you there, that her God isn't your God. Her God is Satan, because she's a Satanist, of course. So, belief in Satan makes her believe she's doing the right thing. That's how it should read, that's what it really means. One third of Americans don't believe six million Jews were murdered during the Holocaust. And neither do I. In fact, it's the biggest pack of lies ever pushed on us. And it's pushed on us so much that if you say, No, I don't believe that happened then your class is a holocaust denier, uh, anti-Semite, um, because it is a lie. Six million Jews didn't die, and they didn't die the way that they were chosen, that it was portrayed. They died from um, starvation, um, malnutrition, because Germany was busy f trying to fight the evil satanic axis of evil known as Britain, America, and all the rest of the, the satanic-run uh, countries. And so they were put into camps. They came willingly from Russia because they were treated so badly in Russia and they put them in there and they grew their own food as much as they could. Um, and did you know that the, the chimneys at Auschwitz were placed, were built on top of the um, so-called extermination centres after the end of the war because they were never extermination centres. And the proof of that is the chimneys only went up so far. In fact, they were so low that if they had used Cyclone B, as they claim, to, to gas the, 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 these Jews, they would have gone up the chimney and come down and killed everyone around it. It's a total scam. An absolute fake scam. And we've many of us have fallen for it, but many are now seeing that it is a pack of lies. And when 
at least one third of Americans realise that. I hope that there's the same amount in this country and other European countries, but we will see. Macron vows to push on with reforms despite protests. Now what that means <coughs> is Macron is continuing to try and implement the new world order. But he's not going to get away with it because at least the French have got a backbone and have stood up and said, no, we're not having any more of this Zionist Rothschild run shit. French president goes on offensive with New Year message calling to end of to hateful attacks. He's the one doing them. I'm not going to read the rest of it because there's it's more about that. Isn't Happy New Year, big tech. France starts taxing Google, Apple, Facebook and Amazon. I don't believe that for a second because Google, Apple, Facebook and Amazon are all the brotherhood corporations and he's in the brotherhood and they, they, they have a rule that you don't tax your own brethren satanic brethren of course I'll keep trying 200 times determined Cali migrants say they will keep attempting dangerous channel crossing arranged by traffickers armed with guns and swords now you've got to ask yourself why and the reason is quite simple because our satanic government wants them here to destroy our population and so they give them houses while we have men, women and children on the street starving. They give the houses to anyone that can get here. Time to end our government for good. Exclusive Iranian migrants promise to keep attempting perilous crossing. Rumours swirling in tented community that UK access will be harder after Brexit. People smugglers were said to be in the camp yesterday but migrants were too fearful to point them out saying they came armed with guns and swords six more detained in Kent this morning bringing total since Christmas to 95 Home Secretary Savid Javid has uh, cut short holiday and de declared major incident yeah yeah you've got to ask yourself this they're in France which is a supposedly safe country why would they want to get to Britain? Because they've been told what they get here. That's why. Top, doc, top doctors chilling claim. The NHS kills 130,000 elderly patients every year. And I know this personally to be true. Professor, professor says doctors use death pathway to euthanize to the, of the el, euthanasia of the elderly. Around 29% of patients that die in hospital are, are on controversial care pathway. Pensioner admitted to hospital given treatment by a doctor on weekend shift. What's that going to do? The NHS, NHS doctors are prematurely ending the lives of thousands of elderly hospital patients because they are difficult to manage or to free up beds, a senior consultant claimed yesterday. If you're 45 or all over, they'll be putting you on the pathway if you go into hospital. You, you are much, much safer at home with your family looking after you. Don't go to hospital. The pathway is they starve and dehydrate you to death. And I know this personally because they did it to a someone I know. And her family were there and they didn't know what was going on. Of course, you can't try telling them. No, I wasn't there, it was my, a friend of mine was there. I, you can't try telling them because they'll just think you're crazy. Because, of course, they're still brainwashing to believing hospitals are, are for your benefit, your health, when in actual fact they are a, a massive tool of the New World Order depopulation plan. The Guardian. <clears throat> UK's top judge says colleagues are seen as being from another planet. We are all products of our background and our experiences. So the greater the diversity, the better. Javid, two more ships to patrol channel. Yeah, believe that when I see it. Mirror. Hot or cold? Yeah, crap. Jimmy Osmond suffers a stroke. 
New Year, new hope for IVF couples. This is fake news because keep it in your mind. Their plan is to depopulate the planet. So get, getting, me, me, helping to make uh, the, those that can't have kids pregnant is the bottom of their agenda. Absolute bottom. They, they're making us infertile with the chemtrails and the poisons and toxins they pour down our throats. Um, that is nowhere near anywhere on their agenda. Express. May. I'll turn a corner on Brexit. <clears throat> Javid orders our vessels back from the Med to tackle crisis. Border boats called in over channel migrants. Jimmy Osmond, the stroke, blah, blah, blah. Daily fail. Why are so many women working as ghostbusters? Home Secretary Hutton, he orders two ships back from the Med to police channel. They will bring rescued migrants to UK. <clears throat> there you go. It's not to keep them out. It's to make sure they get in safely. They will bring rescued migrants to UK. Savage Javid. Traitor, treasonous bastard. Twelve more including child. Ten land in Kent. France accused of pitiful response. All at sea. He's a Satanist, plain and simple. Jimmy Osmond suffers stroke. Waste of paper, Daily Star. The beast bites back. Brits coldest winter. Wait a minute. They said that. The papers said that. Beginning of December. Oh, it's going to be the coldest winter ever. The beast from the east. It's them Rus pesky Russians are controlling the weather. Even though it's chemtrails and harp. And yet it's been the mildest winter that I can remember, I can recall. Because if you remember, the word actually comes from uh, ancient Egypt where they chopped up Osiris, chopped his willy off. And when you remember, you are putting his willy back on. So recall things because then you can't re re don't, re don't forget them. But if you remember, you can also forget. So I recall. Tell lie graph. Javid backs down and sends in more boats. Two vessels sail for channel as only cutter on migrant search sits in port for two days. US deal impossible under May's Brexit. Churchill's ghost story inspires old men. He was a Satanist scum sucking murderer. Just look at what he did to Dresden, a, a civilian city that he bombed, then went after the bombing had stopped with firebomb, after the bombing had stopped, they came out to try and do it. He bombed them again. He was one of the biggest war crimes against humanity, Churchill. Small changes that will have a big impact on your waistline. Chinese credit crunch raises global fears. Energy cap could cost households 200 but it's supposed to be helping us give us more money off not cost us more hmm been lied to again then just like bin laden except we've just changed the word slightly to bin lied henry prince of baby names i Javid recalls boat from Med Patrol chan to, to Patrol Channel. Home Secretary orders two vessels to return home, return from operations near Greece to assist ships already off southeast England. Border force arrests 12 Iranian migrants, including a 10-year-old child, after dinghy comes ashore near Lid of, on, on the Kent coast. New drive to tackle people smuggling rings to continent and as we heard earlier what they're actually coming for is to make oh look there's, there's a boat full of migrants quick let's get them bring them on and take them back to port it's to bring them into the country not to keep them out Ole Gunnar Solskjaer I am back home at United I guess he must be the new manager phone companies targeted government vows action on overcharging how about how about this for a real out there idea Stopping the rollout of 5G because it's an energy weapon against the public. 
In between is 10 years on. The best job we've ever had is behind us. Who wants a five day weekend? How AI could change our lives? Well, we should have had a five day weekend uh, back in the 80s, but because of a treasonous government, we now have to work two jobs, both both working and all that sort of thing, to just to survive. So um, that's the way it should be, a five day weekend, because if you think about it, we get we, we work, at the moment we work at least five, some seven, work five days, and we get the weekend of the deal, the weekend. Anything but independent. My look back on 2019, yes, 2019, time traveller. Why second cities aren't second best? When will pay gap injustice finally end? when we get rid of the money system. This could be the year of the lioness. New year begins with a bang. Energy firms axe cheap tariffs ahead of price cap. Consumer groups warn that the best deals have disappeared. By design, because they know, look, they, they, they invent new taxes. Anything they can invent as a tax, they will do because their plan is to keep us poor because you can keep the, the, the control of the poor, so they think. If, they're too, if we're too worried about getting money to get food onto the table to keep us fed and keep the gas and electric on to keep you warm, you won't be too concerned with what the criminal activities are going on in Parliament. And it is criminal activities because all that ever happens in Parliament is criminal activities, activities acts against humanity. The Times. No more shoulders to cry on as couples seek robot counsellors. Merkel targets Trump with vow to defend global order. And of course, that would be the new world order she's talking about. Optimistic, optimistic Britons defy gloomy Brexit outlook. Half believe they won't be worse off, poll shows. May urges country to move forward together. With this satanic bitch, I don't think so. 2019, let's it, let it be known as the year we took back this planet. Dennis Healy. World events do not occur by accident. They are made to happen, whether it is to do with national issues or commerce, and most of them are staged and managed by those who hold the purse strings.